Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Colonel Cobb, and today we're going to be doing a reaction to the Revelations trailer. We're going to be watching the first trailer that they released, and then we'll watch the newest one that they have, that Treyarch have released. I have watched them a couple times to get some inside info about it. This is going to be my first talk about it on YouTube. So, let's dive in and watch the trailer. Okay guys, so here we are, we're about to watch the video, I'm all set, I've got my earphones in, so let's get into the video and see how it goes, I've only watched this one, so this part here, every story has a beginning, and then in the background, that looks like other maps that are flashing up from like, the other Call of Duties, okay. Unimaginable evil manifests all around us. That almost looks like origins and that almost looks like mob of the dead. So much of the past has returned. And an end. That could end here, let me pause that there. End and end. That could sort of Maybe this could be the final zombies map for Treyarch. With our fates in the hands of a madman. Truly we have reaped what we have sown. Now that, that looks interesting. That looks like some sort of teleporter oh or God. something. What have I done? Stop it, Edward. Breathe. Mark this. The background there, that looked like no there was an apothecary. Back to back. Even if it's for the last time. Whoa, okay. That looks crazy. Well, 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 that looks so good. Far out that map. This is the first actual time I've actually sort of taken it all in properly, but it looks so good. Treyarch, they've they've been I can tell they work they've been working hard on this map, that is for sure. So now we are going to watch the second trailer that Treyarch released uh, a couple weeks after the first one, and this one is called um, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 a Revelations Prologue 1. So that could hint that there's more to come. So let's dive into this trailer and see. I have watched this a couple times just to have a geese at it, so we'll just talk about this more. Uh, let's recap a bit, shall we? So this part here looks like it's sort of like the start before the zombies and stuff happened. So far, so good. Mm, okay. Okay. But things started to go wrong soon after you arrived. That. That's Maxis, everyone. We finally had the Maxis reveal. If you don't know who Maxis is, he's the scientist behind all the zombies and the hellhounds. He was the one that created them all. And we finally had the reveal of him. Oh my gosh. So wrong. But you did the right thing. You followed the plan. Oh, so Nikola there, that's the summoning key from Shadows of Evil. You destroyed that bloody machine once and for all. Thing is, Max's went and balls everything up. He heard voices, you see, calling to him. Only together can we prevent the destruction of your world. It wasn't really his fault. You know, he hasn't actually got his soul yet. All I got was a brain. Anyway, the key thing, as in the thing that is key, 
is that Max is fiddled around with the summoning Zenmu King and accidentally released an even bigger bastard. Oh, it's the Shadow Man. Someone even I didn't know was in there. The Shadow Man. So the Shadow Man, he's from Shadows of Evil. That is crazy. Got way too far out of control. This isn't any vague woo -hoo 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 evil. We're talking about the Apothecons. The most powerful and evil and the Apothecons. All the existences that ever existed. And now they're here. In our perfect world. I'm not going to sugarcoat things. It's a fucking shit show. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, that looks absolutely ridiculous and I'm hyped for this. But because I'm on Xbox, I get it a lot later than PS4, which sucks, but minute it comes out, we'll be playing Revelation straight away, jumping straight into it. But that looks absolutely ridiculous. That map from the first trailer that we saw looked crazy. And I'm so excited for this. That just looks ridiculous. We've had the Maxis reveal that we've been waiting for. And everything just looks amazing and Trey Huck have definitely put some hard hard work and time into the last DLC for Black Ops 3 which is Salvation now I do want to talk to you about something I do get like with Black Ops 3 and you get all these DLCs and you hardly get to play them like you go on multiplayer and you rarely play on the new maps like it's ridiculous I don't think I've even played on most of the maps from DLC 3 and DLC 2 and DLC 1 like it's crazy like your best chance is to play like they have bring in a mode once a DLC is released and they'll bring in that so you can just play those maps but like no one plays them no one plays on those mo modes for some reason but anyway, I hope you have enjoyed that video. I hope you are hyped for Revelations and the Salvation DLC 4. If you liked, smash that like, thumbs up button. If you're new around here and you want to see more videos like this one, press the subscribe button. If you want to follow me on Twitter for recent updates on my channel and videos click on the link in the description below anyway guys Connor Cobb signing out